My name is Emily Davis and I'm from Capestone Organic Poultry. We're based in the Pembrokeshire Coast National Park. My role here is uh, normally sort of marketing, uh, PR and also sustainability. At Capestone we have been uh, producing poultry from the 1920s and we are producing um, organic chicken for top tier retailers uh, such as Marks and Spencer, uh, Whole Foods based in, in London, uh, as well as food halls such as Harrods. We're producing chicken all year round, organic and free range chicken. Uh, and then at Christmas time, we are producing uh, organic and free range turkey as well. Uh, another extension of what we're doing, which uh, has been an interesting trial for us, is uh, producing a small birds such as Pusan. The bigger scale factory opened in 1998 and from that we've grown from um, producing 70 birds delivered into the local Marks and Spencer store in Carmarthen to now producing uh, over 20,000 chickens a week as well as uh, just over 50,000 turkeys at Christmas. We've got over 400 acres just around me here. We've got over 200,000 birds on site at the moment so uh, there's plenty of work to be done by, by everyone. My background, I uh, have grown up on a poultry farm. We primarily do turkeys at home at Cookerville in, in Hanford West. And uh, I've worked for various um, agri food businesses such as uh, Cowpots Ice Cream based in Whitland and lots of other sort of smaller food companies, which has given me so much experience. And then I went to university in Swans University and I studied uh, marketing and uh, public relations. Very soon afterwards, I, I got a, a job at uh, Capestone Organic Poultry. If you're in public relations, you're constantly dealing with, with uh, a people, a product, an issue or an opportunity. And you need to take advantage of all of those things constantly. I do an awful lot of cookery demos and the whole idea is to be obviously promoting the product, to sell more product but equally to be able to engage with our customer. Uh, we really wanted to build our website and have a uh, sort of a very soft sort of rebrand. It's an e-commerce site, so it's an online shop. As we haven't got a farm shop here, it was the easiest way of getting around that issue. Social media is becoming more and more important constantly. We are far away from all of the activity of Cardiff and London and beyond, but it's so important to work extra hard then to be engaging with our customers and to be monitoring what our competitors are doing. That means writing blogs, that means constantly updating the website, um, that means being on social media on a daily basis. We need to be more active within the community and that was one aspect of trying to build a brand very softly to put ourselves out in the county and to be actively doing stuff with schools for instance. So I um, had an invitation to become a STEM ambassador and it, and it really fitted in with where I, I saw us going with regards to community engagement. So far we've had 170, well over 170 pupils uh, through the farm gates and it's really important uh, we feel that they actually understand to be able to link this site, this way of farming to what they're actually eating so they don't think it just comes from a supermarket. We need to be uh, educating the future consumer, which are those pupils within the primary school and the secondary school. Another element of why we actually engage with the, the schools and local people within the county is because they could actually be our future staff. You know, we, we're employing over 130 full-time staff here and the skills that we need are tremendous. They're, they're so extensive and um, you know we can bring in uh, a poultry vet, uh, a farm vet, a uh, head of technical, uh, operations, accounts, marketing, hygiene team. There are so many different career options within this industry and we're constantly finding it a challenge to, to uh, recruit locally but also to recruit those people, especially young people that have got the correct skills that we need for these jobs. So. Um, Although we need to fix the problem now, we also want to go to grassroots level and actually educate them and invest in them so one day they may actually one day want to say, oh yeah, I'd love to work at Capeston. If you believe in the product and if you believe in the brand, it is so much easier to be able to go out and market that product and market that brand. I really want to um, promote the food and drink industry and also promote the, the, the food and the drink that we produce in Wales and the 
the career opportunities that are available and I want to promote that to Wales and way, way beyond Wales. We have got so much to offer and there are so many opportunities and it, it really is up to us producers to go out and really, really shout about it.